If you've used other music software before, you're already familiar with some of what Live can do. This is Live's arrangement view, which is the familiar timeline way of working with music software. Time is laid out from left to right, and tracks are stacked vertically. Live also has another view, however, called the session view. In session view, time isn't represented at all. The tracks are stacked from left to right. And these boxes here can contain what we call clips. A clip is any piece of musical material, from a few notes to a whole song. In the session view, you can start and stop all of the clips independently of the others, and they always stay in sync. This is a great way of performing live on stage or experimenting with musical ideas without having to worry about where they fit into a song form. It's a great way of writing music, too, because you can record everything you do from the session view into the arrangement view. You can toggle back and forth between the session and the arrangement anytime by pressing the tab key. Writing music in this way isn't really like using music software. It's more like playing an instrument, because you get to experiment with parts and build a song as you go. Live comes with a great collection of instruments and effects, so you get everything you need. And you can load devices, move them around in your set, and even route signals between tracks in real time, so you can stay in the creative flow and never stop the music. That's just a taste of what Live can do. You can check out how other artists are using it, learn more about it, and even try it for yourself at Ableton.com.